Tonight, a summertime town hall at Gunning Rec Center on Cleveland's west side as Mayor Bibb and other city leaders talked with residents about crime, homelessness and other concerns. Our senior crime and justice correspondent Lydia Spara was also there. A week before the 4th of July, this chaos at Edgewater Beach, where 16 people had guns. One man was wounded. On the 4th, in the early morning hours, Cleveland officer Jameson Ritter was shot and killed while serving a warrant. Then hours later, a 10-year-old was killed by a drive-by shooter. There were seven homicides over that holiday weekend. I recognize that it has been a challenging couple of weeks for our city. Cleveland's mayor, Justin Bibb, holding a summertime town hall despite the dark news. Uh, we've been making some positive strides, I believe, around our public safety. He emphasized recruiting is getting better. New recruits aren't making more money. And Bibb says retention is working due to bonuses and pay raises. But this was not just about safety. New people that start elected, you're letting this community down in a way that I've never seen this community be let down in my life. And then Bibb let the community have their turn. I came for just to see what was happening around the city. I didn't have any specific issues that I wanted to bring up because really I don't feel like they'll be addressed anyway. My problem is the homeless people under the bridge on 150th. You know, I understand they're homeless, but you know, they say it's a state highway patrol issue but they're on city street. Issues in Cleveland, crime, homelessness, communication, then this, the most powerful voice from this 10 year old. Why are bid buildings in Cleveland being abandoned, but not like being reused? Hmm. She was certainly brave. The mayor was not alone at the town hall. He had several people from his cabinet there taking questions and promising to look into their concerns. It lasted for about an hour and brought somewhat of a crowded room. Betsy. Well, you can bet we'll be following up on all of these topics. Still Absolutely. To Lydia Sparrow joining us from the newsroom tonight. Thanks. Sure.